Outrider, what can I do for you? Tell me, Dr. Zahidi. Careful. That's the very last satellite uplink on Enoch. You don't know how long it took me to find it. How did you even know to look for it? My father. I found reference to it in his notes. After we landed, he was out here looking for a signal. Long before we were. He was the first one to send expeditions. And back then, I was just a kid. You came to Enoch as a child? Hmm. Not many kids were on board the Flores. My father, being who he was, had the luxury of bringing his family. Why didn't we know about the anomaly before we landed? I mean, surely it must have shown up on the surveys. I assure you, this is not the world we were promised. Every report that came back to Earth told the same story. They had found the Garden of Eden, not some world that would be trying to kill us in every conceivable way. We would have stayed on Earth for that. So what the fuck happened? I don't know. My dad, he knew this planet backwards and forwards. He was on the science council that chose this world. Obviously, something happened during the 67 years we were asleep in hyperspace. Something changed this planet. The, um, anomaly. Can you explain it? Well, short answer, no. They call it an anomaly because it can't be explained. It defies all known physics. It seems to be some fundamental force of this planet's nature, electromagnetic and gravitational. But it's also a kind of weather system that obeys rules and can even be forecast. Sometimes it shines, sometimes it rains. Mostly rains. I have theories, but the scientific method depends on observation, hypothesis, experimentation, and finally, peer review. The problem is, I have no peers left. If you ever find a moment, I would like to hear more about your fellow outriders. I was just a kid when they were all rounded up and driven off. Must have been fascinating for you, Outrider, waking up in the future.
I've been wondering. Is it possible there are other Outriders still in Cryo? Well, it's entirely possible. Jane and I... We weren't expecting to find your team, and with insurgents closing in, we didn't have time to look for anyone else. I don't have to tell you how dangerous the First City is, but... I'd want to be the first to know what you find. I'm curious too. I'll go check it out. Just because you haven't found any other Outriders yet, that doesn't mean they're not still out there. The cryopod I found you in was in an old medical... Searching there. Hey, Zahidi. Why did no one else think to wake the Outriders up for 30 years? Well, after what happened to you in the forest, they told us they were trying to find a cure. But they never did. But if there's no cure, how'd you know it wouldn't kill me when you opened my pod? I didn't. I'm sorry. I was only concerned with finding the uplink. Sure. Got it. Priorities. Some writing here. I found a transfer order that says ECA moved most of the cryopods to a different location. Some B2 facility. I've got an old map here. Looks like B2 is the big pod across the bridge. Should be on your left. What's the quickest way there? Try following the city walls. They'll lead you close to the facility.
I'm inside. I'll look for the cryopods. I found Skarsted. What are you talking about? He's alive? No. ECA turned him into a terrarium. Oh, come on! Skarsted? Damn it. I fought with that bastard in Baghdad and Caracas. He never gave up. He was supposed to end his tour of duty on his feet. They all were. Zahidi, the ECA was experimenting on us. Did you know? No. No, I didn't, I swear. But the Outriders were patients zero. It makes sense they would study you to save others. And kill half of us off in the process? That is fucked up. So what did you find? No one else made it. I'm sorry, Outrider. But the fact that some made it, that your cryopods kept humming for all those years, against all odds, you should count yourself lucky. Yeah, well, we'll see about that. As long as you live, so do the Outriders. Remember that. <laughs> 